Hello guys. Thank you. So right now I am currently getting ready to pick up my son from school and get a few things while I'm at the store to cook. This is my official first video. I'm so excited. <laughs> um, I'm going to start this video with thank you for watching. Um, I think I'm going to show a little bit of clips of how this look came about. I think I'm just going to show you guys my eyes and my lips just because I didn't record much of how I did my face. We'll see. Um, so yeah, I'm excited and I think I've been talking about posting a video since what November yeah since November we're in December it's December 4th it's Tuesday and at the end of this week it's my birthday I wonder if I'll do anything I'll let you guys know so yeah look at my daughter how cute she looks she looks so cute that hat's a boy that's my son's but that's okay so um yeah we're gonna run to the store I'm kind of bit of a I'm in a hurry right now so I'm gonna end it right here for now when I get back, I'm going to show you guys what I'm going to cook and maybe show you guys some michelada, okay? Thank you guys for watching. I'm talking really fast, but I'm so excited. I'll see you guys soon. All right, guys, so I already did my foundation, powders, contoured, all that fun stuff as well as highlighted. Now we're going to go to the eyes. Um, I'm going to use the NYX Perfect Filter. I'm going in with a kind of like gold, kind of glittery color on my lid i normally like to go in with a very light or a glittery kind of lid i always have been i've always liked the way that my eyes look by the time that i'm done with my eyes right now i've just been doing like a glittery color so that's what i'm putting on my eyelid and i'm using i don't know what these are called but i've been using these forever that's all i think i've ever used for my eyelid I can't do brushes. I don't know why. So don't judge me right now. I can't do brushes. I I love these. It's either this or using my finger and I'm not using my finger. Um, so then I'm going to go in with my other palette. And if you're interested in kind of and me doing like another video of showing all the products and what I'm using for my face, I can do a separate video for that. I'm just going to quickly do my makeup on the camera kind of finishing it up not doing my makeup finishing it up so do that then i'm going in with just a lighter brown on my upper lid with the brush to give me some color on my eyes I'm just going back and forth on my eye So I'm not going in with my eye too perfect. I'm just making sure that I have some kind of color on my eyelid. Uh, and then I'm just going to go in with the brush to kind of make sure I have any product that's fallen to just dust it out because I hate seeing powder or just fallen product in, um, on my cheeks or anything like that. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill in um, at the side of my eyes. I don't normally like the feeling of not having any color on the side of my eyes or lids. The side of my lids. Come on, Nancy. So I'm just going to add some product. It's like a darker brown on the side of my lid. Going like with the darker brown on the side. So now under my lid, I'm going to grab a thinner brush to go in with those same colors and go under my eye. The other one, I think I'm just going to do the lightest brown under my eye. Thank you. 
wow, I just rubbed that on my eye. Do I stop? When I do this, I'm also just making sure the product doesn't stick to my face. And I kind of blend whatever I have going on, my contour as well as my highlight. So after that, I am going to add the baiting fashion. So the liner is on. Somehow I always get makeup on my fingers. The next thing I'm going to do is add mascara. And I wasn't going to do lashes, but I am a lash girl. I just love lashes. Like even when I don't have makeup on, I will add lashes. I thought about getting like eyelash extensions. Then I hear bad things about eyelash ex eyelash extensions, and then I don't want to do it. And this mascara is running out, by the way. So that's the best that it's gonna get. Should I do lashes? Sometimes I do want to do lashes, and then sometimes I don't. Where are my lashes? Let's use lashes. I'm using Adele Wispies. Just Adele Black Wispies. These are the lashes that I always use. I just cleaned them yesterday, but I'm going to take off the glue from yesterday. So I cleaned them before I put them on yesterday. I'm going to outline my lips. So after I outline my lip, I'm going, like I said, with this purple color. Them to make them blend. Powder. So yeah guys, this basically completes my look. Um, if you guys are interested again on seeing like a whole makeup tutorial, I can definitely do that. But for now, since I'm just trying to quickly show you guys what I do um, I thought why not start with the eyes and the lips um, if you guys like this look give it a thumbs up um, and if you guys want to see like more of a, like a makeup tutorial let me know and I'm more than happy to do that so yeah what I'm gonna do right now is I'm going to take my daughter a bath and then we're gonna run to the store because I need to get a few things that I run out the grocery store because that's where I'm always at is in the grocery store when I say I'm gonna get stuff to go to the store, and then I get all this. I got okay. McDonald's, good times, and a happy meal. And I'm not sorry at all. Monkey. Should I get this all inside? Oh man, I dropped this bag on the floor. So yeah guys, but I still will show you guys how to make michelada even though the plans are... Um, yeah. Even though the plans of getting groceries didn't happen, my daughter slept the whole time. I think because she just hasn't been feeling well last day or two. So I don't, don't mind the hamburger. Oh. I'll fly out everything.
No, I'm in here. Want that off, honey? Yeah. She really does not feel good. Mommy. Yeah? Mommy, I want to color a puppy dog page. Okay, do you want me to go dress you? Uh, yeah. Actually, I don't want to color. How was your day today? Good. Good? Did you learn about Elf in the Shelf today? Yeah. Yeah? You're so cute. My little sick one doesn't feel good. What's the matter, honey? Oh. Mommy, oh, where's my happy milk? Oh, she's warm. What, baby? That's mine. I think that's sisters. I love how the school, I have an app that the teacher sends us like pictures with the kids. They like, today's the day that they learned um, how to talk to firefighters in case of an emergency and it's just so cute how in this school like they learn all of these things. I love how they learn things at school and I was going to do off on the shelf here at home but if I did off on the shelf I felt like they would it really. I don't know I felt like they really, really I know she wouldn't know what I was talking about but now I feel bad that I didn't do off on the shelf while he's home, so I don't know. Um, I don't always do fast food, but there's those days, like today is really cold, where I wanted to go to the grocery store. I definitely wanted to do it before I picked him up, like I said I was. But she was asleep the whole time, and I didn't want to wake her up. Since it's only 4 o'clock, I'm not going to show you guys just yet on how to pick me to my house because it's way too early and I just ate. Um, but I did want to show you guys kind of how I make them at home. I do make mine with pickle juice and people are, are always, every time I go somewhere, so let me tell you a story. So every time I go either to a family gathering or just anywhere, I was like, wait, I'm going to friends' houses because <laughs> I don't have any friends. Um, anytime I go anywhere, I always, if I know it's going to be like a party gathering kind of thing, I like to always bring like my stuff to make enchiladas. So I always add pickles. I add pickle juice <coughs> to my to my enchiladas, and I re I, I do remember my my cousins. I do remember my cousins husband he couldn't believe that I was putting pickles in my enchilada he was just thinking like what are you doing that is so much it's it sounds so odd like right now you're probably thinking what in the world like pickles with beer I don't know if there's you know what I'm gonna look up right now if there's a beer that is like a pickle pickle taste so I promised you guys I would show you how to make micheladas. So I have a few ingredients of what I do here at home. And yes, I have to pick it. I have pickle juice. So first, um, I'm going to start off with some ice in a cup. I like using these clear cups because I get to see how much I'm putting. And I'm not going overload it either with the beer or overload, overload with the clamato. If you add too much clamato, it just... It's like too, the texture is just like nothing. So I'm going to start with um, Bud Light. It's one of my favorite beers. So I'm just going to add to, as you can see, um, to the cup. I like to just fill my cup so I don't create too much foam, which I created too much foam. And while that's calming down, I'm going to grab some of these. These are the pickles that I was telling you guys that it's just it's the best to put into your beer. If you use other type of pickles, it's just not the same. Um, so I use these pickles and I got the big ones so I like to take them out and cut them because I don't want like big, big chunks. Sometimes I add like the whole pickle depending on how I want it really pickly. So I'm just going to add like, I cut a few parts up. Maybe use the whole pickle. Why not? I can really As you can see, it's like calming down just a tad bit. I took too much, I started with too much blood, probably because of the ice. So I can get through the ice. 
As you can see here, the foam is coming down. While that's happening, I'm going to add, I already have cut up limes. I always have to add limes because everybody here adds lime to everything. Add a whole half a lime. Quarter of a lime. Not a half. Then go back with the pickle, see how it's coming down just a little bit. Going to add a little bit more. I think that's good. We'll stop at that. Add some pickle juice. This has to be like the type, if you're wanting a good michelada and you're wanting to add pickles because you like pickles, this is just optional. This is, it gives a really good flavor because of all the like type of herbs that they use. I don't know what they use in this. I guess I can use the ingredients, but I'm not going to. It just makes it really good and it's not so heavy. Then I'm going to add some tomato. As you can see here, I kind of left pretty much that much left, which is about an inch, I'd say. Maybe I'm not really good at measuring. And add the rest with clamato. Enough to where it starts to give it some color. Not to where it's like not to where it's like super super heavy and it's just like red. If it's so red, that's just it's killing it. It's it's killing the the taste of the beer. And it's just you're not gonna like the taste because this is so thick. It's so thick and you don't want it to have too much of it. So I add that. The type of seasonings that I add are a little bit different. The only thing that I add that's really, really different is garlic salt. Garlic salt, I don't know what it does, if it's like the garlic flavor or the, I don't know what flavor it gives it. It's really salty. <laughs> I don't know what it does. I'm just gonna add a few um, dabs to that. Add some beer salt, lime. A little bit of that. I completely almost added the tahini, um, but I only use a little bit. I've had this for almost, let's say, half a year. So yeah, I always have like a bar set up when I do like family gatherings, and this is like something that goes by really quickly because I'm making multiple drinks. So and I'm not a bartender, and I've learned this from my sister-in-law. But I'm going to add just a tad bit of that to my drink literally just a tad bit because if i add too much it depends on how much of a flavor you want with this i add just a tad bit because i don't want it too strong as i'm drinking it add any of this just right now because i want to get heartburn before i go to sleep um you can add tapatio cholula tabasco add any type of hot sauce that you're wanting to add to your drink so yeah so then i just mix up the drink and as you can see here the pickles and the eyes Sometimes if I use like big ice, I add one just big solid, just big chunk of um, my pickles because right now my ice is, oh, my ice are small, so I'm able to add a whole pickle on there, which is my favorite. And the only thing that's left is I add the jumbo straws. I love the jumbo straws just because it doesn't take me a while to keep sipping on it. And I always hear about not drinking and not having drinks with straws. I don't, I don't know if that's true. But um, that's basically how I make your enchiladas. And I hope you guys enjoy this drink. Of course, everything that I add to my drink is optional. If you guys have like different ideas on what you guys add to your enchiladas, let me know. And I'd love to add it to this concoction that I made. It's just delicious. I absolutely love this drink. Um, Literally everywhere I go, like a family event, I always take my stuff with me. All of this fun stuff that you just saw me create, I always take it with me because you never know what you're going to get. So if I'm out somewhere and I don't take this, I either have like a, you know, a Moscato. Um, that's the only type of wine that I would drink just because it's sweet. It's on the sweet side. Or I'll have like an apple cider drink. What is it? Those um, angry orchards just because I don't like straight beer. But um, I hope you guys liked how I made this drink. I hope you guys try it. If you guys do try it because you guys like micheladas, let me know, comment down below, and let me know that you guys tried it out and you guys like it. So um, I'm gonna end this video now. My kids are getting grouchy, and it's almost about that bedtime. It's getting close to it. We go to bed by eight o'clock during the week and sometimes on the weekends. 
because I get really tired. So uh, let me know what you guys think about this first video, and I hope to talk to you guys hopefully soon, maybe tomorrow. All right, bye.